Boom. Good morning, you guys. <laughs> yeah, it's been like two weeks since I recorded, but like a week since I uploaded a video. And boy, has this been a week. Y'all, we had a really bad storm. And lately, I don't know, we can have like a little baby storm and the lights go out. So it was, it was raining, y'all, and it was thundering. It was real dark. So I told my mama, I said, Go ahead and charge all your stuff because you know what's been happening lately. So I kid y'all not, not even 10 minutes later, boom, we get a power surge. The lights goes out. It goes out, flickers back on, and it flickers off. Later that day, the house was getting a little steamy. Okay, so we're just like, all right, bet that up. It's hot. Let's turn on the AC. Turn on the AC, boom. Ain't no cold air blowing. Um, <laughs> uh, no. This is not happening. That's like one of our biggest fears for the AC to go out because it's real expensive to fix it. Come in, baby. Look how she's trying to come in. Look how I'm peeking through. Don't mind my room. I'm finna tell y'all what's been going on. Hey, baby. You wanna say hi? Do you wanna say hi? So, boom. AC not working. So, because it's so expensive, we say, you know what? We're just going to thug it out. We're going to see what's going to happen. Because <laughs> we had got a quote, and they were saying it's going to be about minimum $6,000 to fix it. When you don't have plans to fix something, and that thing is expensive, you got to wait. Okay, so we was just like, you know what? We're just going to thug it out. Y'all, I kid you not. It was like day three, and we was just like, no. <laughs> Because we're going to try to thug it out to December because y'all know in South Florida, it get a little cooler, child, by December. So it was like, okay, bet that we're going to just thug it out. Thug it out for now. In December, rolling around, we're going to be straight. And then we should have the money. We should be able to pay for it. Bada bing, bada boom. Third day, we're just like, no, absolutely not. So, um, long story short, we were struggling for eight, eight, about eight days. Hot. House steaming. Humidity on high. Like, it was just really, really bad. We finally got our AC Monday. Today is Wednesday. We finally got our AC Monday. And now things are back to normal. Now, because the house was so hot and steamy, there was a lot of things that I did not do. <laughs> One being, I did not keep up my room. It was just, I didn't do nothing. That's why I didn't vlog. Like, it was just, like, we were just so afraid to, like, get hot. We didn't cook. Like, it was just bad. So, Today is kind of like a catch-up day for me. So, I just cleaned the bathroom. I'm about to clean my room. I have to cook some spaghetti today. Spaghetti my favorite, y'all. Y'all might as well just get used to me <laughs> making spaghetti. So, we're going to make spaghetti and then do a few other things. So, that's what we're going to do today. And um, I'm excited to record again. I always miss recording whenever I have to go without. Um, so, I'm really, really happy to get back to it. Um, so yeah, let's get into cleaning this room. 12 seconds later. Right, you guys, so the room is clean. That actually took, that actually didn't take as long as I thought. You know how you be dreading stuff just because you think it's going to take a long time and then you actually do it and it only takes you like 10 to 15 minutes. It was really quick to clean my room, so um, I still got energy, so I guess we're going to cook now. I was definitely going to wait till later, but I got energy, so. Let's go cook spaghetti. definitely like hours later um i kind of like like i don't really like that's london eating in the background if y'all that that's london um sometimes i don't like eating my food like as soon as it's ready um <laughs> um sometimes my brother agrees 
sometimes I just feel like it needs like all the flavor and everything. It just needs time to settle. I already tried it. It was good. So I know it's going to be good. But I just, you know, like I said, when I show little cooking segments, I feel like it's only right that I eat it with y'all. So this is what I'm having for dinner. It's about 10 o'clock. Yeah, it's a late dinner. 10 o'clock and then I'm having this to drink. This is one of my favorites. This is what I'm having to drink. Super excited. So this is the meal that I make like when I really don't feel like cooking. But y'all, it's about to, it might be a, like a little cooking segment every vlog because like I told my sister, I feel like I've been playing with cooking too long and I really want to be good at it. Um, so I'm about to just start cooking. Trial and error, right? <laughs> I love spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Alright y'all, I'm finna watch one on one. And I'll check back in with y'all later. Well, maybe tomorrow. Because it's late. Um, yeah, bye. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Hey guys, so it's definitely been, I think it's been like a week since the last clip. I have been so busy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I have been so busy and um unfortunately I'm burnt out um it's a lot that I'm trying to do like I was telling my sister like it's a lot that I want to do a lot that I'm trying to do but at the end of the day like there's so much that I'm not in control of and it's just really like I think that's what's most frustrating about it that I'm not in control of almost like really nothing um if you believe in the Lord, then you know why I say that. Um, but, like, you know, he's in control of everything. So, all I have to do, or well, all I can do is, like, really be patient and, like, you know, just follow his lead. But, like, sometimes I be wanting to be like, come on, God, I want this to happen today. <laughs> you know? Um, so, i just been really, really burnt out. Um, tomorrow is Saturday. So, I think tomorrow I'm going to just take off from everything. Kind of just chill tomorrow but i think i want to go to the beach y'all i think i want to go to the beach and kind of like you know how people be having like sunday reset and they do the whole like you know like you know the skincare and all that that ain't me but um i i, I kind of like to like reset by like just really chilling maybe watch some tv um you know maybe eat like my favorite snack or favorite food or something like that just really kick back but i think tomorrow i want to go to the beach don't quote me though because i think i also want to flat iron my hair because i've been looking rough and i don't like when i look like what i'm going through <laughs> so i don't know i think even if i flat iron my hair because i am I'm about to wash my hair i'm about to flat iron it and get myself a trim and then i think tomorrow i'm going to the beach just to kind of just chill for a little bit. And then, um, I think I'm going to go Olo, though. I think I'm going to go by myself. I don't know yet. But, um, yeah, I think I'm going to just go to the beach. Just chill. Just, you know, reset. Detox. You know what I'm saying? And hopefully, um, hopefully, like, I feel like rejuvenated. That's what I need. I need a break so that I can feel rejuvenated. Um, it's funny though because I be like tired and stuff like that but like anytime I think about vlogging and stuff I be so excited like it's just like where did the sadness go? <laughs> but like that makes me really really happy. But um yeah I just wanted to chime in. Come and come come in come in come in and, and talk to y'all and let y'all know what's going on. And um yeah I, I'm finna wash my hair. Y'all wanna watch that? I'm gonna, um, if anything, I'll probably speed it up. No, I'm not gonna record that. So maybe that could be part of my reset. I don't know. But just know that tomorrow, we might go to the beach. So, stay tuned. Actually, I saw me in the bathroom. Get my hair ready. It ain't even really all that dirty. Um, but, um, I just want to flat iron it, so... Um, I know one of my previous videos, my good sis asked me for like products that I use on my hair. I'm be honest with y'all, I kind of just use whatever I can get my hands on. Um, honestly, by God's grace, I kind of just have good hair, so like she responds well to like a lot of stuff. Um, but I do want to like find some products that, um, I want to stick with so I am trying some products now like I'm gonna show you the, sh the shampoo that I'm interested in it has a conditioner and like all this 
it has a conditioner. Well, the got conditioner, but it got shampoo, it got conditioner. Um, they just it's a whole lot. Let me show y'all. Where is it? Where is it? So this is the shampoo that I've been using, and I really like it. I kind of like really favorite tea tree. Um, so if anything has tea tree in it, I'm definitely down for it. I really, really like how this makes my head feel, how this makes my hair feel. So I'm interested because they got a conditioner, so I'm interested in the conditioner and um, it's some other products that I'm gonna try. So once I get like my products down pat, then I share with y'all like everything that I use on my hair. Um, I can show you the grease that I use because I've been using the same grease since I was a little girl. My mom, we ain't never really switched it up. It's a little dirty. So this is the grease that I've been using since I was a little, little girl. I strayed away from it probably like two times, but nothing does me like this. This is heavy though. So like when I, I'm about to flat iron my hair, I'm not going to use it because it does weigh the hair down. So that's why like I'm interested in this new product that will allow my hair to get like the oils and stuff that it needs that i think my hair needs um without it weighing it down but this is what i use for my scalp so i don't have dry hair and things of that nature because you know dry hair your hair fall out and i don't want to do that so this is what i've been using but us honestly other than y'all i just really use whatever i can get my hands on but 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 i am working on like a hair regimen um and then i'll share with y'all um once I figure that out. But yeah, so this is the hair combed out. Here is the hair washed. All right, blow dried. Uh -uh. I mean, y'all saw me do this last time, but this, I mean, just can't, let me zoom in for y'all, hold on. Yeah, I call myself, I call myself giving myself like a trim. I think last week, last week I gave myself a trim because uh, the stylist that I used to go to, her prices is raising like the gas prices. So, <laughs> I can't go to her. So, I call myself, give myself a trim. Would I recommend it? Absolutely not. Um... But I did it anyways, just because I really needed my ends cut. And it made a really big difference today. Like, it was easier for me to um, detangle my hair. I didn't have as much shedding as I normally have. Um, even to get, like, little curls at the end, it was easier. Hold on, let me see if I can zoom in. Like, the hair is just, it's just healthier. You get what I'm saying? Let me do this out so y'all can see. Hold on. It's just healthier, so I don't know. When things get better for me, maybe I'll go to her. But for right now, boo, <laughs> I feel just, just you know, just do my hair myself at home. But <laughs> this is me. <laughs> ooh, ooh. When I learn how to curl my hair for real, for real, oh baby. I'm gonna be unstoppable. Right now, I just know how to do it just a little bit, just a little bit, but when I learn, <laughs> look at <laughs> I let you guys, it's real late, it's about one o'clock. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap my hair up and then I will see you guys in the morning. Hey, good morning, mama. Say good morning to the people. Hello, people. Good morning, people. Good morning, people. I'm chilling with my mommy, people. I'm chilling with my mommy. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day. Um, yeah, we ain't going to the beach. <laughs> I don't know why I keep trying to plan a beach day prior to actually going to the weather app. And it was this morning. I think it was this morning I checked. To see what the weather would be like because i wanted to see what time i was going to go to the beach because i wanted to go before sunset so that we could watch it together because <laughs> like in the past like we've always made plans to do that but i never actually did it so i was like i'm just take y'all with me but it's supposedly raining all day it's actually raining right now too it's real dark outside so um we're not going to the beach today um so right now i'm getting ready to read my bible 
and I think I'm just gonna stay inside all day and um just kind of rest and you know watch some TV probably listen to some music do some work I know I'm supposed to be resting but like I was telling my sister I'm not physically tired I feel like I'm just like I'm mentally like exhausted from like being an adult <laughs> Being an adult is really, really hard, um, especially when like when you have like plans to do other stuff. Like, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. If I didn't have plans to do anything like entrepreneurship, I don't think that I would be as like overwhelmed and burnt out as I am right now. Like when I used to just work a regular nine to five. Like if anything, I was stressed at work. But the moment I went home, like it was fine. But being that I want to do more than just that I feel like that's why like I'm burnt out and I think that um I'm not doing enough of what brings me joy and that's YouTube YouTube uh, working on my business I'm gonna tell y'all more about that at a later date <laughs> working on my business and just other stuff those things bring me joy and I'm not doing enough of them um and I think that, you know, like just that whole balance thing, y'all, I don't have it yet. But, um, so I don't feel like I need like a day off where I don't completely do anything. No, I just feel like I need to do fun things today <laughs> to say, to, you know, for lack of a better word, I feel like I just need to have fun today. So, um, I might do a little work here. I might either work on my business or work on YouTube and that'll be it for today. So that'll be it for this video i love y'all thank y'all so much for watching me thank y'all for supporting me it means a lot to me and i will see y'all in the next video